Hi, this is Christine. I'm here with a slider card that uses the Slimline Twist and Slide die set along with the Shake Your Merry Maker Stampin' Die. So here's the entire die set for the Slimline Twist and Slide die set. So I've already made a different video where I showed the twist component and today we're just going to use the slide component. So there are four dies that you can use to make a slider card, and they're all right here. So there is a smaller one so that your object will just move a little bit. I'm going to use the one that I'm pointing to right now, which is sort of a curvy slider. So I'm going to put the rest away. So I have here a slimline card panel that I've already inked up with several distress inks and the blender buddy. So I've used tattered rose on most of it and then on the outside used worn lipstick and then scattered straw for the sun. And now I'm just going to place the slider die where I want it. And you can ink up your panel afterwards. That's perfectly fine. I just preferred to do it before. And now I'm just going to tape it down and then run it through my die machine. And so here is the Santa from the Shake Your Merry Maker. I'm going to have him sliding around back and forth. So that's the idea for this card. So here I've I've dyed it, I've cut it out. And the way you make this shaker is you have a penny and then you can use a component um there's a slider element that is sold by different companies. We don't have that yet um, in stock, but it's just a plastic piece that then attaches to, um, you glue onto the penny and glue onto your element so that it can slide back and forth. So I want to contain the sliding. Um, I don't want Santa to, um, you know, twist around too much. So I'm putting some foam, double-sided foam tape on the front and on the back so that the penny can easily move. Um, the penny provides a lot of weight and so allows the element to slide back and forth more easily. So it's really a good thing to use. So I've sped up the video now because I'm just removing the release tape. I'm going to add a snowy bank that I've die cut off camera. And so Santa, a lot of Santa's hidden, so I decided to add um, some double-sided foam tape and prop another one on top of there so you could really see him sliding around in all his glory, and half of him isn't hidden around um, on the back of the card. So here is the final card. I've added a lot of trees from the Happy Little Tree Farm, and I hope this was helpful. And hope you have a great day. Thank you for watching.